Oh my god, I'm so glad you're here right now. Two things, right off the bat. Day four Venom. Excited. Great. Making a vlog. Yeah. Second thing, which is really actually two things, so I guess technically it'd be three new things. I have something to show you. Look. It is the Starbucks brand new tumbler. See-through tumbler. And it's customizable. It comes off here, so you can customize the inside. It's got, like, the little marking thing on it. But you can write what drink you like on there, and they'll make it for you. And, or you can put, like, a picture or something in there. But I saw this, and I was so excited because I've been waiting for three months for this to come out. Who would want that? I mean, seriously, look. Oh, wait. There's something else new here. Look. See these? See these right here? Fuck hate bands. Hell to the yes. Super excited that these came in. You can't really see what they say, so I'm going to try to fix it. Can you read it? No? Alright, well it says, don't be hating on the homos. Well, I ordered these about a week ago, and I'm so glad they're here today. I was super excited when they came in the mail because that means I have something to talk about. <laughs> I'm sorry, my throat is all messed up tonight. But anyway, fuckhate.com is a campaign that is against LGBT bullying or homophobic jokes or douchebags who don't know what they're talking about. If you were to go look at that website right now, the very first video has basically F-bombs dropped everywhere. Basically saying, why the hell or, in this case, why the fuck are you hating on the homos? Why? There's no reason for it. You know that, I know that. When I first saw the video on fuckhate.com, I laughed so hard. So hard. And, like, right after that, I ordered the bands, and then I followed them on my Tumblr, and then followed them on my Twitter, and then followed them on my Facebook. And I think you should do the same. Because anybody that stands up for gay rights like they do, deserves to be recognized. So let's try to put them at the top of the list, okay? Uh, up there with them is the It Gets Better Project. The It Gets Better Project was started so that we could stamp out LGBT suicide attempts. Now, I don't know if you were watching the news or anything or reading articles, but within the past couple years there have been numerous accounts of teens who have committed suicide because they were bullied for being gay, lesbian, transgender, and stuff like that. It's a wonderful project. I made my video because of them. They're the main reason that I started coming out to anybody. So, go check them out. Link right there. Uh, I know you'll enjoy it. I know you will. But there's so many people there that are just talking about how they came out and how it gets better and how it's just wonderful to be yourself, whether you're gay, straight, bi, lesbian, transgender. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Um, another page I want to talk about is the No Hate. Uh, campaign. NoHate.com was started by Adam Bowska and his partner Jeff Parshley. Now, Adam started this because he saw an amendment that was trying to be passed called Proposition 8. Proposition 8 was made so that they could amend the cost Constitution to make it illegal to have same-sex marriages. Now, if you don't know by now, uh, California did defeat Proposition 8, so good for them. Adam got a hold of this. He was super, superly outraged. So he started the campaign. Now, Adam is a photographer. Um, if you just go to the website and look, you can pretty much see that from the beginning. He does photo shoots in LA all the time. Um, people wear white, they get no hate written on their face, and then they do duct tape. Now, the no hate campaign basically has anyone from like lower class citizens to like military personnel, newlyweds, law enforcement, uh, artists, celebrities, politicians, to say. Now, um, I know there's like a link on that page where you can add a no hate stamp to your uh, profile picture on your Twitter. I recommend that you do that. I haven't done it yet because I can't figure out the app. I'm not very good with that. If anything, just stand against a white wall with a camera and write no hate on your face with some duct tape and you'll be good to go. Another project is the Trevor Project. Uh, 
Trevor Project was created many, many years ago uh, for the LGBT uh, youth and communi community. Uh, they have a hotline, all kinds of stuff for LGBT youth that are thinking about committing suicide or just need to talk. Now, I don't know if you watched last night's episode of Glee. I just watched it a little bit ago. About halfway through the episode was the It Gets Better commercial produced by Google. Google was basically trying to support Google Chrome, but I just think it's awesome that something like this is finally reaching the airwaves, where everyone can see that there's a community out there for them, whether they have connection to the internet or not. Now this commercial is 100% supportive for everyone. If you haven't seen it, I'm going to put a link in the doobly-doo for everyone to look at. Uh, I'm going to post it on my Tumblr, so if you want to see it there, you're more than welcome to. While I'm at it, follow me on Tumblr. I'm always posting stuff about the LGBT community and great stuff, like the It Gets Better song by Todrick Hall. Um, the video is on my page. I posted a poem yesterday about it. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So I'm going to put all the links in the bottom. Um, there's going to be a few here. So I guess just follow me. Uh, keep checking in, see what's up. Venom number four. Done. Bye, honey.